Um, definitely a questionable team, to say the least, from our opponents. But I guess we'll try and make it work. Oh, you are on coins, and team of the season is just round the corner. I've got nothing left. Well then, head over to MuleFactory.com for the cheapest, most safe and reliable coins and use the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for 5% off your order. Okay, so we're back. Another week, another challenge video. Big thanks to all the people that checked out last week's video. If you haven't already seen it, basically we allowed Amigo to choose our foot champs team. But literally, if you checked basically a week ago, you'll see last week's video. Anyway, today we are letting our opponents choose our foot champions team. So you might be thinking, how does this work? Are we messaging them? No, that would be extremely long and painful probably. And probably 90% of them won't actually reply or have some sort of settings that don't actually allow you to message. So not always the greatest situations. But basically the plan is to get around the formation at the start then go into 11 different foot champions games probably most likely quit most of them as well so we're gonna you know we're gonna be down the pedestal a bit this weekend league and basically every opponent we get one player from their team and we get a choice but don't get a choice in a way so basically we're gonna go work our way from goalkeeper through the right side to the left side to the right to the left all the way to the end play if that makes it i'll try and explain that a bit more later that's basically the task at hand if you guys do enjoy this video please do smash the like button and let me know in the comments below the next challenge you would like to see. Anyways, I guess we get ourselves into some of these games and uh, see our first few players for this team. All right, so like I said, before we get into the games and the opponents, let's quickly get a randomized formation. So we're just going to close our eyes, count to three, two, one, and see what formation we get. All right, so onto the formation section. As you can see, hopefully my eyes are closed. I'm not cheating. Let's just do this in three, two, one, bang. We have got the four, three, three bracket Two as our formation for today. What? So that's pretty simple. Obviously, a goalkeeper, four defenders, three midfielders, three attackers, or well, well, two wingers, a striker. It's pretty simple. Anyways, now it's time to go into our first game, find our first opponent, which we'll be getting the goalkeeper from. Let's see who they've got in there. Right, it looks like we've matched our first opponent for this video. Let's see what team he's rocking. So, goalkeeper for today is Eduard Mendy. Team of the honorable mentions as well. So, it's not bad. It's not actually a bad keeper to start off with at all. So, let's go back over to the squad screen and chuck him in goal. All right, we're back over to the squad screen. This Mr. Eduard Mendy is in net. Thanking you very much. All right, so we're back over to FIFA after getting our first player for the team. I will actually just point out as well, uh, you know, some of these players might come down to price-wise. If I've got a different variant of the player in my club, I might have to choose them. Because, I'm not going to lie, I'm currently sitting on uh, 500,000 coins. Which isn't the most. Anyways, enough of that waffle. Let's go and find our second player, which is going to be our right-back. So, our opponent's right-back, unless they're playing a five-back. Let's see who they're rocking at right-back. Oh, opponent number two. I completely forgot to change my screen there. But if you didn't see, it was the new foot captain's right-back in Dubois. So, he is now our right-back. Let's get back over to FIFA and let's chuck him in the team. And there he slots in. Uh, right back. Lovely jubbly. Play number three. Now we've got a centre back to choose. I guess we could choose any of the centre backs a person's got in their team to chuck in as one of the centre backs. I don't think that's, you know, cheating really. All right. Opponent number three. Oh dear, I didn't really think about people using like bronze teams for free wins and also silver teams. So, yeah, no, out of that team on your screen, I'm going to go with, I think, Twan Zabi. As he is like technically a United boy, even though he's not at United at the moment, he's on loan. We're going for Axel Twan Zabi. Well, I can't lie, I wasn't expecting to put a silver card in here. I could have upgraded him to his, uh, I think it was his wild card card. But you know what? Just to make the video a bit more challenging, we've gone for a silver card. That is player number three. Okay, well, that took a little bit of a turn. I'm begging we don't face any bronze teams here because if we do, a bronze player is getting put in the team. Oh, Neil. Let's go find whoever centre back is. Please be good. Okay, opponent number four with two options of both Cordoba or Chris Smalling as centre back. I guess the probably more obvious option would be to go with Smalling. I don't know how much his card is currently sitting at. I mean, it's actually a lot cheaper than what I thought it'd be. 41,000 coins for a card like that. Well, we'll definitely go Smalling then. The UEFA Conference League Smalling can get straight into that team. Let's go put him in now. Well, there we go then. Small Dini is in there. All right, let's go find our final defense. Defender for the team, the left back. Okay, opponent number five. Who is their left back? Oh, yeah. you know what? To be fair, in terms of gold cards, Teo Hernandez isn't the worst. Like, it could have been a bronze. It, that's what we got. We got to realise here. It could have been a bronze. Let's go trick him in our team. And Bosch. Just like that, the defence is completed. And also, Hernandez, I forgot, links to morning, So that kind of worked out all right. Next position on the agenda is a CDM. So I guess we could take any kind of central midfielder. Some of that will hopefully fit in there. But if there's a CDM on the team, it will be definitely taking one of them. All right, opponent number six. Here we go. CDM. They don't have a CDM, but they do have Mr. N'Golo 
Kante, who is technically a CDM. And I guess so is Correa, or however you pronounce his name, De Bruyne or not. I think we'll go Kante, to be fair. I think we're going to take N'Golo Kante. Now, that's the player we'll go with. Let's go and chuck Mr. N'Golo Kante into our team. And there we go. Kante is now in the team with a lovely hunter on him for some reason, as, you know, a defensive midfielder. Definitely needs a hunter. Yeah, <laughs> of course. But now, on to a central midfielder. It doesn't matter if they're left centre mid, right centre mid. Uh, you know what? We'll go right centre mid. This player is going to play right centre mid just for chemistry to make it a bit more challenging. Right centre mid. Let's go have a look. All right. Opponent number seven. Who have, oh my god, Lord. Wow. Um, yeah, slight issue. I think literally all three. Well, definitely Hullick's out the budget. Fernandinho is an SBC, and I sadly didn't complete him. And then we've also got Captain's Melito. He had a midfield for whatever reason, obviously chemistry-wise, but yeah. Uh, okay, I don't really know what to do here. I mean, sadly, Melito does kind of break the budget as well a little bit, as we currently now have a whopping 394,000 coins instead. Yeah, it's, it's kind of looking muddled right now. Uh, okay. Let me, let me just have a little think. I honestly think, you know, as we cannot afford any of them players, I mean, we could get a base Melito, but he's not really midfielder. So, we'll go with a base card of someone else. It's none other than a base Fernandinho with a whopping 59 pace as well. Okay. Let's hope this next midfielder is a good attacking one, all right? I guess we'll go find out who it is. Okay, player number eight, reveal yourself. <gasps> wow. Uh, okay. We've got a slight issue again. Oh, God. Okie dokie. Uh, Alright, well, if you didn't see, uh, I, I mean, I'm pretty sure you did. You could have literally just rewinded the video. The guy had flashback Neymar, moments Matthias, or future stars Pedri. The thing is, I do actually own Neymar. So, <laughs> I guess we could technically put him in the midfield. But at the same time, chemistry really doesn't work. And also, he's not really a midfielder. I could get a different Matthias, or we could just get a different Pedri, I guess. I guess that's the, the cheap option. This is what happens when you've got no coins. All right, I need to go over to Mule Factory myself and get some coins next time, I think. And I decided to go with Man of the Match Pedri. Uh, we, yeah, I've used this card before. Doesn't really improve the midfield too much. It's fine. Let's just get onto the attack and hope we get some good players there. Okay, so we're looking for a right winger or a right midfielder here. Oh my God, it's, it's foot birthday, Sancho. Oh, it's foot birthday, Sancho. Nice. Such a good card, man. That is such a good card. But I think we're going to have to buy one's torch and say, you know, you guys know that you guys know the deal right now. If I had more budget, I'd, you know, go for the foot birthday one. But sadly, we don't. So let's go get He's one star watch. And just like that, one star watch Sancho is now in our team. On to, I think we'll go left winger next. All right, the penultimate player is about to be revealed. It's none other than an informed son. Okay, that's actually a pretty solid card. Like, I'm chucking him straight into this. I'm happy with that. I'm actually very happy with that. Son in form can get straight into my team. That's decent. And there we go. Son is in the team and he's shushing the opponents. I mean, we, we haven't got an opponent yet, but, you know, hopefully he can score and he can hit the shush and we can win the game. All right, striker now. Let's go and find the creme de la creme, the final piece of the jigsaw, our striker. Please make it someone good and... Someone that I can afford, I guess. All right, it's all come down to this. The striker is about to be revealed. Oh, we've got an option of two here. Okay, Vardy's Europa Conference League road to the finals or Rodrigo's foot fantasy upgrade. Oh, that's actually quite a hard choice, you know. I actually don't know who to go for here. I haven't used either of these cards. So, you know, Vardy actually links with a strong link to Sancho. So I might go for that just for the chemistry. I think that might make the most sense. And just like that, we've got ahead and pull the trigger on the road to the final. Jamie Vardy as our final player for the jigsaw up top. Okay, well, all the players are in. So let's quickly go back over the team right now. In goal is honourable mentions Mendy. Right back, we have Dubar's captain card. We have then Tuan Zabi. And right centre back, left centre back is Rosa the final. Smaller left back is then Normal Hernandez. Then we have CDM Kante. Right centre mid is then Fernandinho. Left centre mid is Man of the Match Pedro. Right wing is Wons to watch Sancho. Left wing is Inform Son. And striker is road to the final, Jamie Fardy. All right, well, team is completed. There's only one thing now to do is get into a game with this team. Okay, so let's go find our opponent for this team. Let's see what team we're facing and see if we can win. All right, foot chaps. Hi, baby. What team's he got? Not a bad one, realistically. There's some nice players in there. But well, let's see what our team can do. You know, the people have built the team, technically, the opponents. Let's now get a win with it. All right, that's the aim. All right, let's do this. Come on, then. Let's see what we could do. All right, let's knock this ball about here. Dubois captain card. It's quite a decent card, to be fair. It should be pretty... Okay, never mind. I'll take it back. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Well, I was just picking up Dubois and this attack has come from him. So... Small is there, though. We're good. Oh, no, no, you're... I'm just going to not pick up players anymore because apparently when I do, that happens. Skins look sure there, to be fair. 
Put that ball in. Oh, that's a very good ball. What a ball. What a save. That was an incredible pass. I can't lie. Middle. Nice. Fernandinho, nice. Pedri, nice. Vardy, nice. L maybe. Yeah. Oh, still got the ball. Son, Burrow. Go on, whack that. Human Son. There we go. It's one all. Beautiful. Okay, we're back in the game. Let's go and get the win from here, all right? Let's go and get the win. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, well, I moved my keeper and uh, it didn't really work out very well. I'm not going to lie. Uh, that's 2-1. Good challenge. Vardy. Vardy's got a bit of space here. Please, Vardy. Do not let me down here. Oh, I I've let myself down. No, I haven't, Vardy. Oh, I kind of thought I mucked that up then, but... It's good. We scored. We're fine. <laughs> We're back in the game. Oh my god. This is a chance. This is a chance. Vardy into Kante. He's got the hunter on for a reason. He has. <laughs> Three, two. Come on. Love that from Kante. Oh, what a flick from Jamie Vardy back into him. Bang. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that goal. I can't lie. That was actually pretty nice. Uh-oh. I don't like this. Oh my god. He's nearly scored being kicked for you. are joking me. Oh my god. Stop it. Son. Son, make something happen. What a ball. What a ball to Vardy. Finish it off. Oh my god, it was top, top bins. And I think the guy might be quitting. Is he going to quit? Hey, we got a rage quit. You know what? I'm pretty happy with that first game with this team. And we win 5-2. You know, I wanted to win and we got one. So that's a complete dub to end off this video. We don't have to play another game with a team. And we've won pretty impressively as well. Well, there we go then. That wraps up my opponent's choosing the Foot Champs team. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said earlier, please smash the like button. And let me know in the comments below any future challenges you'd like to see. Hopefully you enjoyed this one though. Let me know anything you'd like me to change in future videos do you want to see more gameplay or whatever let me know in the comments below if you got this far as well you guys are an absolute legend really really much appreciated but yeah anyways guys thanks for watching please like comment and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and i hope to see you guys next time goodbye <laughs>